and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys, and today I'm going to be going over my lineup. Now, if you guys don't already know, I'm doing a lineup update. My team's gotten really, really good, guys, and I sound congested. I'm sorry. I'm a little sick, but, I mean, I think I sound fine, but I know for a fact I don't. You guys can probably hear it, but going over the team, guys, I made quite a few changes. I spent a few million coins on this team. I spent quite a few coins. The team's looking really solid, though. I gotta get back into Weekend League and Seasons because with a team like this, I should not be sitting here just making videos. I better be playing with it. So I gotta get back into that, guys. Get into this lineup update. But as you guys do already know, quite a few players I've been talking about picking up. I did pick them up. And also, guys, this is the 25 days till Pood Miss. That seems to be the name you guys kind of agreed on in the comments. So do not forget, this it's daily giveaways every day up until the end of December. So don't forget, all you gotta do to enter. Alright, so pretty much also to throw this in here, guys, make sure you are subbed to the channel for this giveaway because I was thinking about it. If a bunch of random guys and YouTubers just popping into my channel every day just to take the giveaways, I wanna give it back to the, to the Madden fam, the Poodle community. So make sure you're subbed to the channel if you're new. Sub, come join the family, and then you're automatically answered. So make sure you're subbed and everything else. I'll explain the rest of the rules in the video, but I just want to throw that in there because I do not want to just be giving it away to random people who pop in every day just to steal the coins. All you gotta do is go down below after subbing, hit that like button. And comment down below the secret word you're going to hear throughout the video. You will hear it. It's going to stand out very, very likely. Just comment down the secret word. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. And make sure to comment your system so I know exactly what system I got to give you guys coins on. Oh, very simple, guys. I'll be posting three to four videos a day. I'm going to give a secret word in each one. Now, I will be picking one random video per day to do the giveaway on. So make sure to comment to every video, commenting down below, and liking. And as long as you do all those four things, you have your best chance of winning, obviously, because you enter four times. And then I'll be picking a winner every single day. So uh, the winner for yesterday is mark hawkins now i don't know what system he's on but just hit me up on twitter and you will be the giveaway winner so just hit me up on twitter yeah, that's all you guys gotta do hit me up on twitter whenever i say your name and if you guys don't come to claim it in about 24 hours i will remind you and if you don't i will pick a new winner so remember smash this like button so i can verify that you entered and comment down below so i can pull the comments now guys get into this video so let's head over to the lineup all right and also guys if you're new to the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button turn on that noti bell come join the family boys let's see if we can get to 14k sometime this week and let's see by the end of christmas by the end of poop we could be at about 17k subscribers that's kind of the goal guys so make sure everyone watching hit that subscribe button make sure to smash the like button after the giveaway comment down below and guys also the giveaways will be ramping up every day so as long as you guys keep entering and keep showing momentum on the giveaways we will slowly increase them so as of now we're at 20 i think it was was it 30k yesterday and we're gonna keep making our way up all the way up to maybe gift cards for um, Xbox and PSN, so just make sure you stay tuned for that, guys. Now, a quarterback. We got Lamar Jackson. We finally made the switch. We've been, I've been talking about it for two months now. I want to upgrade to the Vic or Lamar. We made the switch. Lamar's looking like a beast on my team. Now, obviously, his throw mid's okay. His, his, his throw mid's not the best, right? But that's okay, because his throw deep finally has improved. What sucked with Lamar is that his short sucked, his throw power sucked, and his throw deep sucked. I got all those things up, and his mid, his throw accuracy mid is actually decent now. Throw under pressure is a really, really big stat this year with how big the pass rush is, so that's definitely important. His throw power is finally above 90, so he's going to be able to throw crisp passes down the field, and his speed is 93, so you're going to have insane speed, insane everything. 95 agility, 96 acceleration. Let's see what else he's got. 89 jumping, 98 ball carry vision, 87 spin move, 94 juke move, and I'm pretty sure his break sack is a 99, which is freaking insane. This card is looking pretty amazing, to be quite honest with you guys. 99 break sack. I'm loving this card. Got to get into seasons with it to see how much damage I can do. I haven't really got to play with it too much. Definitely excited to do so. Now, at running back, we obviously picked up Barry Sanders. You guys probably knew that already. Our trio here is Barry, Saquon, and Marcus Allen. All three of them look pretty insane with my run scheme. Barry, so, also, though, is looking insane 98 excel 97 agility those are the upgraded stats that i got on him and then obviously has a 94 speed i do need the john madden excel uh, athleticism boost so i can get his speed up a little bit that will definitely help my team a lot once i can get that but this barry is insane obviously people say eric dickerson's better but i'm a big barry sanders fan so i'm sticking with barry now let's get over to fullback which is still Corey Schlesinger. so i'm not going to talk about him obviously he's he's pretty good you know you guys already know Corey Schlesinger. now wide receiver we have michael Irvin, tory holt tyree kill randy moss deandre hopkins i did want to pick up randy moss because his redux came down in price but michael irvin's better in my opinion right now i'll pick up randy moss when the new one comes out now i was thinking if i should sell michael irvin because i know randy moss will get a christmas card i'm gonna want it i haven't really decided on what i'm gonna do with that just yet we got tory holt because he's our free player and tyree kill because you need that speed that speed's game breaking tyree kill will be on my team all year until we get to like 99 speed guys 
I kind of I kind of wish I didn't spend all my coins though I kind of feel like I'm gonna need coins for the Christmas promo, but we'll worry about that at a later date now tight end We got two George Kittles. I'm selling the other one. This is my George Kittle finally made the upgrade at Kittle 93 catching 85 catching traffic 88 spec catch 86 short route running 84 medium route running 87 run block I get him for the run blocking and it only helps that he's like the fastest tight end minus like Darren Waller and like another and Evan Ingram and he's got great catching all around he's kind of like the most well-rounded tight end in the game with athleticism you can't go wrong with George Kittle now secret word of the day is cookie make sure to comment that down below and don't forget to comment your system to enter I left tackle still Munoz not much to speak about with Munoz let's go over to left guard at left guard we're rocking with Bruce Matthews still at center we did pick up Frederick during the Halloween promo definitely worth it this Frederick card is a beast almost all above 90 across the board if I get a few more chems or rushing or anything on my team it will increase him to above 90 everything gave to Castro is just solid because everything's above a 90 and at right tackle we actually did make an upgrade we did pick up Lane Johnson now we have two of them because we're selling the other one Lane Johnson once I power up and come up he will have above 90 everything which is a big upgrade over my other Lane Johnson so I definitely definitely needed that because lovely Johnson was not getting the job done anymore now left end we did pick up Joey Bosa as our free card from the Thanksgiving stuff great finesse move and everything but I do kind of want to pick up Reggie White but I'm really low on coins. It's going to be tough. I, I definitely want to save coins for the channel so I can have fun during the Christmas promo. So for the time being, I have not really went too deep into spending any more on cards. I definitely need to start selling things actually and picking up other things so that during the Christmas promo, I won't be entirely broke. But Joey Bosa is definitely solid. I have Cameron Jordan as a backup. At right end, picked up Aaron Donald. Now, Aaron Donald I've been waiting for for quite a while, but it's they, all their prices came down for the series Redux pack, so I felt like I had to go ahead and go pick him up. 88 Excel is huge. And he has all above 90 pass rushing and run stuffing. Play rec above 90. Great strength. This card's a beast. All well-rounded. Gonna probably stick with Donald for the rest of the year, quite honestly. Now, defensive tackle, we got Ed Oliver, Quinn Williams, and Michael Pierce. You know, definitely could use an upgrade at defensive tackle at some point. I kind of, I'm very weak there, but I have not felt the need to spend coins at defensive tackle just yet. Outside back, we still have Von Miller. This card's been here since, like, day one. I definitely need an upgrade here. I'm waiting for a beastly zone and fast outside linebacker. But for the time being, we're, we're gonna keep rocking with Von Miller. Now, middle linebacker, we got Ray Lewis, Shazier, and Bush. I was in a power play near, but when I compared Lanier to Ray Lewis, Ray Lewis is still very powered up Lanier and powered up Ray Lewis are very, very similar cards, except that Lanier just has better zone. But I typically use a Ray Lewis because I like to have Shazier sitting in his zone because Shazier obviously has a really, really good zone coverage. And with his next upgrade, Shazier is going to have above 90 zone coverage. So he's going to be like a cornerback in the middle of the field. So I really don't want to waste his zone coverage with me using him, considering Ray Lewis is almost just as fast and I can get the job almost done with him the same way. I prefer to I prefer to use a Shazier, but it's kind of tough when you have Shazier with that zone. You kind of want him to be on his own and take control of a guy like Ray Lewis. That if I also use him, I can hit like anyone. Right outside linebacker, we did pick up Lawrence Taylor. Well, we've had Lawrence Taylor. We gotta pick up his new card, I should say. I need his NFL 100 card, but way too expensive right now. That's how oh, I really sucked. I thought I had him already. I don't know where I'm gonna get all these coins from, guys. It's gonna be really tough to get a bunch of coins. I'm really, really low on coins. So I really got to start kicking up the coin. Something. I got to do something. I got to start sniping or something. Because without the coins, I, I definitely want to save coins for the Christmas promo because I want to be able to open up presents for you guys during the promo, get all the new cards. But it's going to definitely be tough to stick up, to stay up to date with all these new cards coming out. Prior to this, I was just fine. I was adding enough coins. I was picking up all the new cards. But it is, it's gotten increasingly hard to stay up to date with all the brand new cards in this game. Cornerback, we have made some changes. We obviously got Theon when we got our power pass. And then I picked up Nitro Lane. Nitro Lane, I was going to sell him only because I feel like I want to get one of the NFL 100 cornerbacks, but he's honestly pretty solid. If I get him to a 93 speed with John Madden, he's going to be one of the best cornerbacks in the game for quite a while, so maybe I don't have to really change him for now, although I was planning on it. Maybe, maybe I'll hold on to him because I was thinking if I switch him out, I'm going to lose a lot of coins on the power-up and everything I did for him, so maybe it's not it's not really worth it. But Nitro Lane, Denzel Ward, Deion Sanders, solid, solid cornerbacks. I think if I ever traded one out, it'd probably be Denzel Ward, just because he doesn't get the zone threshold, but everything else in these cards are really great. Deion's obviously a beast. Everything all around, everything all around is above a 90. Really great looking card. The press is a little low on Dion, obviously, but that's the only thing that sucks. I want to try to mana blitz is that I can't put Dion down. I have to always keep him up, which does hurt me because some teams, if they don't have great enough receivers, I can straight up press when I turn lane and they can knock it off him. But with Dion, I can't exactly do that, which does kind of suck. Now, free safety. Free safety is a position that I want to upgrade. I have Brian Dawkins there. Brian Dawkins gets the job done, but I want that next great free safety. I don't know who will be. Obviously, we're, we are getting. We are getting the NFL 100 secondary, so we're going to get a new free safety, but it's going to be crazy expensive. NFL 100 really just ramped up the price of this game. That's what they want us to do, spend all our coins with to buy packs. That's kind of the goal that they're probably going with here, so it definitely sucks that we need to shout a lot of coins around to stay competitive. Like It's getting really money spent lately. 
all the NFL 100 stuff because it's really hard to keep up with because pretty much every week every position you have is becoming obsolete like they're not the best anymore and they're replacing them with cards that are gonna cost 400k so it's really getting real tough to stay up to date with everything and then a strong safety we have Pat Tillman I'm really happy they gave us this Pat Tillman because I don't have to worry about strong safety all year great hit power great zone great play record great tackle great speed all around well-rounded card definitely love having this Pat Tillman I don't know when we'll get our next upgrades though it could be the next series but I think we I maybe mean, we not see it till like January if it's not this, if it's not this next year, it probably won't see it until like January, February, which would make sense because as a 96 overall, he's probably ahead of the game. He's ahead of the game anyway, so it doesn't really matter. At kicker, we did pick up Tucker. You guys should have known that if you saw the last lineup update. Justin Tucker is a beast. One of my favorite kickers in the NFL. 90 kick pal, 90 kick accuracy. Very well rounded. Nothing too special there, but he gets the job done. Makes a lot more kicks than I could have made before. Keeps it a little more competitive for me too because prior, if I was at like the 40, I just, had, I just had to punt it away. I couldn't kick it. I had to go for it. Now I can at least get field goals and have a better chance at things. And kick accuracy helps. If I mess up the meter a little bit, I feel like he's so accurate, it still makes up for it. But I had a guy with bad kick accuracy. If I messed up the meter a little bit, that thing sailed wide left to right. And then we got Trey Way at punter still. I definitely need an upgrade at punter. I've been, more, I've, I've been rocking with this guy for two years straight. I think I've had Trey Way basically for two years straight. I don't know why I always end up with this guy. Now let's head over to the lineup so you guys, so I can show you guys the full lineup in, 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 like in effect here. Oh, I'd have to put Lane Johnson. Oh, did I sell the Lane Johnson that I had on my team? All right, there we go. So that's what the line's looking like. The line's finally looking really solid. I just gotta power up Lane Johnson, and then I gotta, I'll probably end up keeping Kittle for the year, so I don't really mind having him there. The only guys that I'm iffy about, <clears throat> and I might wanna end up selling, is maybe Michael Irvin. He's a really solid card, but I definitely need coins. And then at defense, Everything's looking amazing. I have no changes to make on defense besides adding Lawrence Taylor. Other than that, I think I'm pretty competitive, and I definitely want to hop into season sometime today after my videos so I can start competing with the team guys. But that is about it for the video. If you guys want to see anything else, like my special teams, I got Tyreek returning. I do need to upgrade my job Madden a little more, which is pretty much the only thing left for my team that I need right now. But guys, that is about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to the channel, make sure to go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn the notification bell, come join the family. Can we get to 14K in the next few days? That'd be awesome, so make sure everyone's subscribing. Come join Poodmas, and guys, to enter in Poodmas, don't forget, all you gotta do is like the video, and guys, the more likes we get, the more enticed I'll be to increase the rewards, but for now, it's 30K, so like the video, comment down below, say what's up, oh, and say the secret word, don't forget to say the secret word, and don't forget to comment your system, and say what's up. That's it, guys, thank you so much for watching. Mark Hawkins, don't forget, you did win the 30K, that's about it for the video, thank you so much for watching, I'm out. Peace.